fair flexibility. Have you ever bought a plane ticket and a few days later saw the fare drop? There's a fix for that with Southwest, adding to the many ways you can save with this airline. Let's get to it. Paying more than you have to, for example, $149 instead of $79 sucks. That's a lot of money, especially if you're traveling with others. So what do you do when you see your $149 fare drop to $79? Log into Southwest.com, locate your flight, and verify how much you paid. Next, there are two options. Note this is going to result in a flight credit and not cash. Option one, cancel the flight. It's easier if you book two one ways to just cancel it, then allow the credit to process, which takes a few minutes or seconds, and rebook. Option two, change. You might be thinking, why change? How does change work if I want the same flight? That was my thought too, but bear with me. When you go to change your flight, your flight will appear in the list, just like you're booking a new flight. Select the flight that you have, Make sure the date and all the details are the same. And once selected, the difference in fare will be listed. For example, $149 minus $79 is a difference of $70. Once confirmed, the $70 becomes a travel credit for future use. It's not quite cash back, but if you fly a lot, it'll come in handy. Even if it's just $10, that's $10 less on another flight. For other Southwest tips, check out our five ways to save with Southwest Airlines and our playlist. Did you know our goal is to save you energy, money, and time in travel? Subscribe for more tips like this. Thank you.